cat slash etc slash os hyphen release it will show the release of the server here you can see it's a 7.9 radar server so in this server i am going to install the postgres sql service so friends if you are new to my channel please subscribe my channel and don't forget to like share and comment also don't skip please watch till end now we will check the status of the postgres sql service using the command system ctl status postgres sql here you can see Service could not found. That means Postgres SQL is not installed in the server. Now we will check the available packages for the Postgres SQL using the command yum list Postgres SQL star. It will show the list of available packages with the name Postgres SQL. Out of all these packages, we will install the Postgres SQL and Postgres SQL server. Yum install. Select the both packages Postgres SQL and Postgres SQL server. Hit enter. Installation started. Enter Y. Installation completed. Now we will check the status of the service. Here you can see Postgres has been installed but service not started. Now start the service. Here you can see service not starting up. I am giving some error. So using journal ctl hyphen xe we can check the log. You can see it's a big log. So what we will do, we will just filter the log. Journal CTL pipe tail minus n 50. Our lib pgsql slash data is missing or empty. Use process hyphen setup init db to initialize the database cluster. That means database is not initialized. So, what we will do? We will run the process sql hyphen setup init db to initialize the process sql service. Initialization completed. Now, start the service. Now, check the status. You can see Postgres SQL service started successfully. So, this is the way we can install the Postgres SQL service and start the service. So, friends, also remember whenever we will face the same issue after installation, now we have to initialize the 
पोस्ट का सेस्पेल डाटा बेस फ्रेंड्स थैंक्स फॉर वाचिंग प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड डोंट फॉरगेट टू लाइक शेयर एंड कमेंट